What's up y'all it's your girl Rista Vegan and I'm back with another video. I know I've been away for a while and it's for good reason because I've been very 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 busy. So yeah I've moved new update in a new house had to get out the old one but yeah we're in a new better house better area giving me the inspiration to film. I just got done doing a little product shoot. I am not sponsored by them I'm just practicing because I am really into filming and doing um, UCG content. So why not practice on some new items that I got? It's Super Goop, it's Unseen Sunscreen. If you're seeing this Super Goop, holla at your girl. But yeah, I was just practicing doing some videos. Still do all my Instagram videos, do my juicing videos, my vegan videos, get ready with me, lifestyle videos, I still do all that. But I haven't been on YouTube in a minute. So I just said, let's break out the camera and vlog and talk to y'all. Give y'all an update. But yeah, just got done shooting a product shoot. This everyday sunscreen. As you can see, I got it on. Very clear, sheer. Also, they got sunscreen for the lips. Very minty. I really like this brand. But yeah. So I just picked up my camera. I'm about to get ready. Got to go to Sprouts, get some fruit so I could juice something. I don't have any fruit in the house and I wanted to make a juice. So yeah, that's about it. What y'all been up to? I haven't heard from y'all. Just because you ain't see me, why you ain't hit me up? Ask me how I'm doing. <laughs> but yeah, about to brush my teeth. As you can see, my teeth are a little bit straighter. Thank you to Invisalign. I started doing Invisalign. What tray am I on? So next week, I'll be on tray six out of 21. So I'm halfway there. So yeah, trying to get these teeth straight. So I ain't got to get veneers. I don't get, gotta get my teeth aren't that bad. It was just certain teeth like right here that had to be straightened. My bite had to be rearranged because I was grinding my teeth at night. But yeah, I'm like, I'm not going to get my teeth shaven down just to get piano white teeth. You know what I mean? So, that's why I got that hoops a lot. So now, just getting ready, brushing my teeth, and I gotta brush my Invisalign trays, put them on wall, and yeah, get ready. So I'm about to finish up in here. I'm already dressed, and then I'll catch y'all. So I just got the sprouts, just pulled in, having me a little juicy juice. I need to put something on my stomach. All I had this morning was my iron pills. So yeah, I'm gonna get some juice in. And it's pure pineapple juice. And how I know, like I tell y'all, like I told y'all in my previous videos, you wanna look on the back. This is my favorite brand right here. Kinda type expensive. It's like, this was on sale, so I got it for seven, but normally it's like nine bucks. And if you figure out a whole pineapple is what, like four or five bucks. But if you're in a hurry and wanna grab this, it's good. I use it for mixed drinks too. I'll probably grab another one. Yeah. But if you look on the back, it says 100% fruit juice right here. I don't know if you can see 100% fruit juice. <clears throat> now they have brands that have um, concentrate in it. So you gotta be careful. That's why I say, even with these, check the back right here organic pineapple juice that's all that's in it look at your ingredients it'll tell you right there that's all that's in it and it's certified and bam non-gmo usd fresh press organic bam so i would say it's worth the nine dollars i'm out here being nosy before i go in the store I don't know. Somebody just parts me. They got a Tesla. I can't get jiggy with Teslas. You want to know why? <clears throat> when they hit that electrical grid and all that stuff shut down, you ain't going to be able to drive. Granted, most of these newer cars have the electrical, um, I guess you call them motherboard chips with these newer cars, but they're gas powered. I'm waiting for the day they come back out with the water power engine. I know they killed off old bull, but watch them come out with it. It's crazy. 
that's how they be doing our people but on another note let's get in sprouts i'm gonna take y'all in there with me grab some fruit what else do i have to grab watermelon maybe a main um melon watermelon melon and some grapes i might do some grape juice i don't know or some fruit fruit just to snack on too because i really haven't got any fruit to snack on i've just been juicing all my fruit so yeah i'm gonna do that tuesday i'll go back to work so i'll probably grab some fruit for tuesday <laughs> circular watermelons don't have seeds and at least they tell you black diamond seedless watermelon so that's a negative for me Obviously ain't got so this one right here. If you feel it, it feels like fucking leather jacket. Like that's crazy. But look for a lot of stripes on it. It sure has like a yellow, yellow bottom like this one right here. On the yellow bottom. And also I do the knock test. I knock on it. Make sure it's not squishy. I finished shopping and yeah I'm telling you sprouts sprouts you gotta do better with your prices baby I can't even lie but the quality of their food in there is top notch they got that quality so I don't mind paying a hundred bucks every time I go in there every time every time sprouts be getting me for my money all the time but their quality is good so I'd rather take quality over the price honestly any day. if you got a sprouts near you they gonna tax you but got my little shake because i ain't eat nothing yet i ain't eat i really don't be eating early in the morning that's the time Oof. yo i stay getting stuff on my shirt <laughs> i swear i be getting stuff on my shirt but mm. this right here baby 
this right here, fire. Mm. On the side note, I'm gonna talk to y'all for a little bit longer before I end this vlog. It is a hot one of the day. I don't know if I wanna go swimming today or not, I don't know. But it's a bonus to have a pool where I live at, so fire. So fire, and it's private in the um, HOA community. It's very private, which I love, I love privacy. Shocking for somebody that does YouTube, I like privacy. But <laughs> side note, I'm trying to get more longer videos. Even my mom's like, your content's very short. I like the short form because that works on Instagram and stuff, but I do need to start doing the long form on YouTube, showing you a little bit more of my life, what I'm buying, what vitamins I use, what I eat, and just my routine on the daily. Last few videos, you know, I was getting back into fitness. I'm still working on my fitness, as you can see. Face getting a little slimmer, baby. But yeah, I've been working hard, working out a little bit more consistently. My work schedule did change, which um working shorter days but i picked up one more day which isn't really gonna hurt me i love the shorter days getting off at a ample good time which really works for me getting off in the daytime so i still have time to work out so yeah but yeah i'm back into the content creation i gotta get back into making more long-form content for y'all on youtube because that's where i'm lacking at honestly i love short form content i love using the user generated content ugc content looking for a brand to hook me up remedy if you out there love your drinks fire pick your girl up but right now i'm starting small i'm practicing what like the everyday products i do have an amazon storefront go check that out all the stuff that makes my life easier makes my home living life easier i got stuff on there so go check that out some links but yeah, your girl is trying to get better with YouTube, getting more comfortable in stores. I haven't gotten to the point where I could bring my tripod in the store. But I'm getting more comfortable where I can go into storms and film. Go into stores and film. I'm still getting used to filming. Not discreetly. I'm not trying to do it discreetly, but trying to get out of everybody's way. One thing about me, I'm not one of them content creators that's going to invade somebody's privacy. Because I wouldn't want that done to me. So all my future content creators, YouTubers, don't invade somebody's privacy. Be nice about it. If you're going to film, try to do it discreetly. And don't be confrontational. If somebody asks, hey, what you doing? Just explain to it. You might meet somebody that's into something. You might get a brand deal out in this world. You don't know. So be nice to whoever you encounter. I'm still kind of nervous about filming and have that edge on my shoulder. But I got to relax. Just do me which I'm still learning is doing me and not worrying about what other people are thinking, which is, I think, the hardest part of content creating. Making content is not hard. Honestly, coming up with ideas isn't hard. Picking up the camera is not hard. It's just dealing with the people in the world and dealing with your inner self because a lot of this stuff is mental. No one's really caring. Some people are caring, caring. But, no, honestly, people really don't care. As long as you're not, like, with the camera in their face or clearly filming them in certain areas. But yeah, even in the gym, when I find, I got to find a new home gym. I don't know. I don't want to do Planet Fitness. LA Fitness is like 15 minutes from me. So I'm thinking about joining a different gym. But the fact of joining the gym, you have to find a gym that's okay with you creating content, okay with the cameras, because a lot of these gyms aren't okay with it, which is understandable. You're there for your mental peace, clarity. But yeah, if you're starting to get a content creation, just bust out that camera, start filming your everyday life. Start filming things you love. Start filming things you do. Make sure it has a purpose. Make sure it's educational. Just start doing something. If that's what you want to do, if you want to hop on the film. If you're a gamer, start gaming. If you're into music, start doing music videos. There's so much you could do in content creation. I'm learning this every day. Like the everyday stuff I do, I'm really going to give you some more vlogs of my everyday life. I got three days off. I be doing all types of stuff. I'm trying to get more workout content for you because I started working out more outside at home. And we're about to pick up a new hobby, pickleball. So definitely <laughs> going to film us doing pickleball and trying that out. But my ass home, I think I'm about to take my ass home. I don't know. I might stop in the store. I do need some white tank tops, more white tank tops, tops. Um, I don't know. 
Because every time I go on this gross, it'd be super packed in a Sunday, so I don't know. So I'm home. About to put this food away. About to get in a workout. Like I said, I'm taking y'all with me. I'm trying to shoot more content for y'all. So yeah, that's where we're at now. Back at the crib. About to put away all this food I got. And yeah, talk to y'all before my workout. So, back to workout. So I'm doing more, a little bit more cardio now. And let me tell you, it's cardio kickboxing. Ooh, that scared me much. <laughs> So it's cardio kickboxing. I don't know how old you are watching this. If you're in your 30s, yeah, late 30s, 40s. I know you know about Billy Blanks. So if you know, you know. Billy Blanks is known for Tybo. It's a martial arts form. It's a workout form. And yeah, I've been doing that. I've been doing his 24 minute workouts, working. I'll do a week of that. And then I'll go up to like his 30, 40 minute workouts. Today I'm going to do a quick eight minute workout. Plus I'm going to do an eight minute course. So 16 minutes. Still giving me a little bit of a workout. Still kind of sore from his other workout. So yeah, I'm going to do something today. Because today's like a chill day. Even though I'm still doing stuff, it's still like a chill day. So yeah, I'm going to unpack all this food. Food, as you can see, organic cherries. Got the oranges. My girlfriend, I made this drink. Well, I didn't make the drink. It was basically a leftover strawberry, like non alcoholic daiquiri. And I added some rum to it. So she tried it. She was like, I want that. You got to make that. So, got strawberries, got the rum. We might cook out later if it don't rain. It's been raining literally ever since we moved in here. It's been raining in the afternoon. I don't know what it is. I don't know. But it's been raining. But hopefully when she gets off work, it's early enough. Where we beat it, where we beat the rain if it does rain, and we pick it up. So yeah, I'm about to put this stuff away, get in a little workout. And yeah, I'm going to holler at y'all. I think I'm going to end this vlog here. I said this last time. But yeah, I think I'm going to end this vlog. Get a little workout in, shower, chill out. Might clean up a little bit. And yeah, it's your girl Rista Vegan, and I'm out.